or triple digits set in for good. Brad Samaro from Ace Hardware is here. He brought so many things today. Good to see you. Nice to see you again, Destry. I brought, in fact, I brought a new friend with me today. I, brought, I was wondering what this was. I brought purple energy. That's the color my daughter selected for her bathroom. Oh, lovely. Because okay. we, have, we have about one month left where we can paint, and we, we redid our whole bathroom for under $125. That's a great deal. And I didn't realize you guys had, so, you have everything that you need for painting. Everything that you need for a painting project. We planned on a Friday, painted on a Saturday, and put everything back on a Sunday. First thing that we did was select our color that's most important, especially for a colorblind guy like me. Mm -hmm. The next thing that you want to do is, if you have a very active kid, you'll want to do some minor wall repair with a couple of things, with any number of things, products in the store. Of course, after you've done that, you're going to want to sand it down to make sure that it's good and smooth. Once you've sanded it down, you want to finish preparing the surface with a good cleanser like TSP, something like that, either with a How household... How important spray. is that? Making sure that you have good surface preparation is the most important thing you can do for a painting project. Really? Okay, because sometimes I skip on that, so good point. Absolutely do not skip. Then, of course, put down a drop cloth. Then you're going to mask the room to areas that you don't want colored. I always use a two-inch brush, something like this, at an angle for cutting or for doing the trim. It makes it real easy. And then, of course, for the gadget-oriented, what you have in your hand there is a corner roller yeah. for making sure that you get a good trim in the corners. Yeah, it's great. They have so many different things that you can do. I mean, this is a corner one. Here's another kind of corner painter here that you can do. Look at that. It's perfect for the corner. All the little gadgets for the painting person in your house. All right, and now they have disposable pans, too. We're talking about Earth Day. We talk about Earth Day. If you if you want to save on cleanup, you drop in this for $1.29 at most of your neighborhood Ace Hardwares, and you just throw it away, and it makes very easy cleanup with soap and water. Yeah, it's so simple. And, and these buckets are great, too, to have on hand. All-purpose buckets to have on hand. All right, terrific. Next, next, I'd like to talk a little bit about scorpions, because I know they've been around with the warm weather. I've Can seen I them in my you? house. Mm -hmm. I've seen it the other day. Mm -hmm. So I'm, we're having a barbecue. We're just kicking back and all of a sudden my friend looks down and goes scorpion and there's like a big scorpion just sitting on our patio they're there to have a little bit of lunch too yeah these so, things are the best though right here absolutely one of the three I want to talk about three things with scorpions today I want to talk about finding eliminating and then preventing their return the first thing that you want to do is if you see a scorpion Grab, oh, it, gra tongs. grab it with some kitchen tongs to dispose of it. Either step on it outside or flush it down the toilet or dispose of it as you wish. Should you step on it? Like, I've heard about babies on the back. Not barefoot. Okay, <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. But you can smash them. Mm -hmm. It's okay. All right. And remember that their cuticle glows in the dark, so go hunting for them at night with one of these black lights this. from UV flashlights. They go from 9 all the way up to 100 LEDs, and they're very good products. You guys, if you haven't seen it before, it's amazing when you put this light, I mean, because they glow that bright. When it, when it becomes really warm in your attic, they're going to look for cool, moist places downstairs, like under your sink in your laundry room and things like that. So those are going to be the places where you might find nests. All right. So there's a couple of things that you want to do. For example, you want to first of all fix leaks uh, in our plumbing department like that, but then you also take, take a look at something like grate foam, which is going to seal the cracks and crevices around your, around your neighborhood place. Another thing you do is we have any number of traps and sticky tapes available. Put one of these in the corner next to the door or behind, the, behind the cabinet. And if you're very creative, put a cricket on there because the scorpions are going to love to eat the crickets. Yeah, and that's the thing, too. Control the bugs, control the scorpions. Can, absolutely. That's one of those things. Then we have some kill-on-contact things like this product from Taro. And then another thing that you can do, sprinkle outside your house, is this green light, uh, might, uh, green light, many-purpose dust that I use around my own home. Oh, okay. Then I've got this diatomaceous earth. That's a real mouthful, but it's really good. There's silicon dioxide in this, and also some bait to attract the scorpions. It gets under their exoskeleton, and it basically cuts them, and they'll die within a couple of hours. All right. What you'll want to do then is prevent them, and you take a real high test thing. Uh, available at most of our Ace Hardware, things like that, and you mix it up in us, and you go on from there. Of course, with all the other critters that you're going to see around, we have a full array of things to control things in your lawn, garden, so and outdoor take living. Take care area. of that, and then my favorite part, really quick before we go, misters. It's hot out there. This will keep you cool. Jimmy Q said at lunch today during the news that it's going to be 100 this weekend. We have a couple of kits that are going to be great for your outdoor living area that install in a weekend. Or if you're more project-oriented, we have all the piece parts in PVC so you can create your own in your outdoor living area. One of the things that we did at my neighbor's house is we took PVC 
and we planned on a Friday, we install on a Saturday, and all the middle school parties are now at my neighbor's house getting rid of my daughter. I love it. It really helps AceHardwarePhoenix.com slash DIY for more information. Don't go away. We have a lot more to come here.